Hello, my name is Benjamin Hart. I'm an American attorney and the managing director of Integrity Legal here in Bangkok, Thailand. As the title of this video suggests, we're discussing the recent, I guess you could call it a lockdown in a sense. They have made, well, they put out a decree basically that 41 provinces are closing all entertainment venues, pubs, bars. And a recent article from Bangkok Post, it's bangkokpost.com, article is titled Entertainment Lockdown in 41 Provinces. And quoting directly, the CCSA would allow governors, including the Bangkok governor, to propose the reopening of entertainment places if they were considered safe. But the final call remained with the prime minister, he said, and he is Dr. Tawisip. And Dr. Tawison is the, the head of the CCSA, the doctor in charge of the CCSA, the COVID, uh, Committee on COVID situation. So, yeah, that, that's where the buck stops on this. The prime minister is ultimately the person who makes the decision regarding the lockdowns, whether they will continue. And by lockdown, I mean these closures, these current entertainment places closures. The prime minister is the person with the final say on that, although it appears that there is sort of an advisory role played by the local provincial governors who can basically say, look, we think everything's fine, and then that's got to be signed off by the PM. So, you know, remains to be seen. It looks like for the next two weeks, pubs, bars, entertainment places are going to continue to be closed or shuttered at least, well, it seems Bangkok and the other 40 provinces that are excuse me, covered under this order. Again, we, we may see changes to this throughout the two weeks. You know, some of the governors may pop up and say, look, we think it's okay here now and go ahead and pull their lockdown off again with the ascent of the PM. So remains to be seen exactly how this plays out. But yeah, the answer to the question posed in this video, who's ultimately, you know, responsible, who, who makes the final call regarding lockdown or this or this recent round of lockdown if you will and that would be the prime minister